Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome as well. In today's video, I just thought it would be very interesting and fun just to show you guys the products that I use to smell good. Um, as you can tell, my hair is wet. Um, so I just got the idea after I got out of the shower. So I'm just like, oh my gosh, that would be a perfect video to do just to show you guys the products that I use. So if you wanna see what I use, just keep on watching. But before we get started with today's video, I'd just like to let you know, as always, if you enjoyed today's video so far, it would be fabulous if you hit the like button down below and subscribe too, so that way you never miss when I upload. All right, everybody, let's get started. So I don't usually stick to just one body wash. Um, I usually buy like one or two. If I really, really like a certain body wash, then I'll buy it again. Um, but I recently purchased the classic scent of Coast body wash, and I just really like the way this smelled. It smelled really fresh, really clean, and the scent lasted after I got out of the shower for a little bit longer than other body washes that I've used. So I really liked the scent, and it was super cheap. I want to say it was around $3, something like that. I don't know. I bought it a little while back, and, um... So I really, really like this body wash. I bought it at Walgreens. So the next product, um, and I'm not doing them in specific order that I use them. I'm just going to pick them up and show you and tell you guys about them. Um, so the next product is by Fizz and Bubble. And this is um, a product I got at Ulta. And this is the body frosting. And this is in the scent Rainbow Sherbet. This smells exactly like a bowl of Rainbow Sherbet ice cream. This smells so good and it is super moisturizing and the tube, I guess you can call it a, a bag, um, it has the little spout, the top, and um, it's very creamy, very moisturizing and this scent does last and it smells exactly like Rainbow Sherbet. I don't know how they got it to smell exactly like it um, because I have smelled body lotions and perfumes in the past that claim to smell like a certain thing and it smells nothing like it, but this smells exactly like rainbow sherbet. So usually I wear my hair up just to keep it out of my face, um, but other times I decide, you know, I wanna just wear my hair down, especially if it's wet, it just helps it dry faster if I wear it down, um, or then, or else I'll wear it in a ponytail too. So just depends how I'm feeling that day. Um, so I like to spray this in my hair. It is the Pink Sugar Hair Perfume. And of course, I have the Body Spray Perfume of Pink Sugar. Uh, so when I saw this at Marshall's a long time ago, for $7.99, I had to get it because it said hair perfume. I'm like, oh my gosh, more ways to smell good. Yes, please. So I absolutely love this. And it smells exactly like the Pink Sugar Perfume. Um, so I also use this as a perfume too, not just for my hair, um, so I can smell good all over. So I'm going to show you the last two products, which are perfumes and let's see, which one should I show you first? Okay, just I'll just show you guys this one because I guess it doesn't really matter. Uh, this is the Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue. This scent lasts all day long and I am not kidding when I say this. It the, the scent just lasts. I don't know. It smells, let's see if I can, hmm, okay. Smells peppery, fresh, and, hmm, there's another scent to it that I, oh. it smells, mm, peppery, like I said before, and it smells, Like a fresh, just rained day, if that makes sense. It smells really refreshing. Um, and you know when the air has that perfume smell after it rains? This is what it reminds me of. Um, so that is the best way that I can describe the Dolce & Gabbana light, uh, blah, 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 light blue fragrance. Um, so the very last one... And no, I didn't just save this for last because it's my absolute favorite. Um, this is the Sauvage by Dior. I wear this every single day. 
This is my absolute favorite um, fragrance. I think it is in Eau de Toile, I think. Um, but I absolutely, let's see. Yes, it is in Eau de Toile. This is my absolute favorite fragrance. This lasts at least for a couple days on my clothes after I spray it for the first time. This, I don't know what they put in it, but it absolutely is definitely worth the money. And this small bottle here was $77 and definitely worth the price. Um, because like I said, it lasts for a couple of days. If you're not washing your clothes, obviously the scent will go away. Um, but if you just put like a towel out and sprayed it on the towel, it, the scent would still linger on the towel days after. Um, so this is definitely worth the money. Absolutely hands down my signature fragrance that I wear every day. I get many, many compliments on it. And a lot of people are wondering, what are you wearing? You smell so good. And I tell them it's Dior Sauvage. Okay, so for the very last one, I just happened to see this on my shelf. Um, this is the Body Fantasies Cotton Candy Fragrance. Love it. Absolutely smells so good. And it's very, very cheap if you want to smell sweet and like candy. So I just wanted to include that as the last one. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, just hit that like button down below and subscribe too. So that way you never miss when I upload. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite fragrance is and what fragrance you wear every single day, what your favorite soap is, body wash, anything. Cannot wait to read those comments. Thank you guys so much again for watching and your support of my channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care.